Oh my, my oh my, it feels good. And it's actually Jace is, is working. Nice. Hey. Come on. Come on. Guys, the newest car owner. Sissy, say hello. Hi. Lucy, Lucy is driving. Lucy, your face, Lucy. I can't. Driving, no distractions. She's driving, no distractions. <laughs> We're responsible. Okay. We're being responsible. <laughs> You're also not being responsible. So, you guys, it's a receiving prize collection of gifts season. We are still going to see a lot of the housemates receive their prizes this week from the respective brands and what they won in the house. These innocent motos, they are very beautiful. Both the one that Levi won and the one that Sissy won, they're just so fine. So, let's get into today's video. I have a lot for you guys. Welcome back to my channel, guys. If you are new here, please want to subscribe. Turn on your post notifications so that you can get the every time I post a brand new video. And do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. Yesterday, Adekunle was just doing the Lord's work. In fact, it was our personal Kayo day. He made sure to go room by room to show us like almost everybody. If not for Adekunle, there are certain people that would have not seen yesterday. So, Adekunle, I am here to say, please, please keep doing the Lord's work. You are doing well. You are doing very well. Keep doing the Lord's work. Keep feeding us with content. I like that, um, you know, we've just been able to see a lot of them. And it's been positive energy so far. Like, after they were done with their meeting that they had inside the house, he was just like, they shout all stars. And they're like, all stars. It was so nice to see. Let's say all stars. All stars. <laughs> <laughs> then yesterday, I brought you guys a message that Perry had for Patriot. And today we have a message from Messi for Mercenaries. Let's just listen to that. Hey, Mercenaries, the Dogu fan base, the Queen's makers, the ones who never got evicted, the ones who ever and ever has turned off the lights two times in a row, the ones who stand tall. My dear missionaries, thank you. I can't thank you guys enough. Just hold on to this. I'm coming. Let me finish this presentation today. I love you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. She said, on now, yeah. And then she also had a live stream yesterday where she was, it was mostly thanks. She was just saying thank you to missionaries. And then she also explained that there are certain times that she contemplated even taking voluntary exit from the house because of she was feeling some type of way. There are certain things that she was feeling nobody saw most of the things i did or oh, you guys see you 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 felt you knew, like you felt you knew me that's messy messy should be that mess thank you guys so much thank you thank you i can't thank you guys enough i see all my people so thank you just erase ah odogu thank you thank you it's not i don't know what else to say apart from thank you because it wasn't easy you know easy it wasn't easy at all. Do you know when you are feeling something? Yeah. Do you know when you are feeling something and you know that something is wrong? Yeah, you can feel it. Over five times, I contemplated on taking voluntary exits. Mm -hmm. Five times, I say I'm leaving. Okay. I could, I could feel, I could feel things, but I still there, and I made it to the end, and to the top. <laughs> thank you guys then you know that video of adekunle and venita that we saw from a distance and while we were looking at it adekunle was also capturing his own i was wondering what where he was going to post it like i wanted to see that view and i finally got to see it online i'm going to be sharing it with you guys the closer version of that video Adekai, they well don't know your company will not burn. So we also had a video of at the end, um, as Adekai, Benita and Ilebaye hugging things out. You guys know they didn't really have the best of times in the house and all of that. So um, they showed where they were hugging. Benita was just asking, "Hope you are good." And then she also said she's proud of her. It was just like a nice 
um, you know, session between the both of them. <laughs> So I guess they are good now. Then Ike and CC, they Ike went to um CCC and it was just like this oh my Ike bestie kind of thing. Ike was telling her she should um, join Snapchat. So it was just like rekindling or oh, is it rekindling? Which English I go use? They, they were shot together. Yeah. Sissy. Hi. See, Snapchat is beg me, oh, I don't beg Sissy to join Snapchat. <laughs> and then we also had a close up view of Cross and Kim. Cross was the one that was making the video. Hey, what's going on, my G? What's popping, my G? What's popping, Yeah, 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 yeah. Hi, guys. We already got it. We already got it. I'm going to miss this out, would you? <laughs> for Ilebaye and Doin, there was also a video of them together. It was Doin on Ilebaye's live stream, and they were just talking about their different fan bases. So you guys should be good. You know, it was just like a thing of um because you guys <laughs> um and Baye tribe they dragged they dragged Doin at some point, and then Delight also um you know had this whole thing where they were defending and then it was also there was a situation between the two fan bases so they're just like you guys were good you guys should apologize to each other and all of that so it was just a video between Ilebai and Doi. Hey, I'm sorry. Please, delight. Ciao, buy a tribe. You love us. Buy a tribe. Tell delight you love us. You love us. We're having fun. And that's a purr. You guys now see. Just join the crew. She's just like a lady. 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 She's just going extensively into all the things that he said for Messi, she just said that um this season she didn't want it to be all about rivalry between her and somebody else that during her season it was almost like it took away from all the other things that she had in the house it was just about fights like her when she came out it was more about the fights so this time around she wanted to show growth and just have a different side um to her being put out there and then her situation with the guys for kid wire white money she said it was basically there was nothing serious right for white money she said it was basically an alliance between them white money they don't carry white money go away no no when they asked her about Perry, she just started by giggling first and saying yay okay because <laughs> that one surprised hey, a lot of good people um... but she ended up saying that um they are friends right and she said what really like ticked for her or what started this final week because you know a lot of people were asking how come this final week um it just started out of nowhere so she said what happened or what like what made her to start seeing things from a different angle was when Perret told her about the conversation he had with angel regarding putting her up so she's like okay why is this guy telling me i know i put this guy up several times and he knows about it so the fact that he's telling me this it means that it's no longer about the game so let me just see how things can go she, that's when she opened up her minds to like what could happen between them so that's why like we saw that it happened like in the last weeks that he already showed some signs of like liking her in the first week but she said to her she was already in that mindset of i don't want to do shipping this season but that final week things just clicked for them then for prayer when they asked about Messi, he also giggled and say ha it's okay oh, Messi, yeah, this last week was quite <laughs> then he said that um for him like this whole thing is not even from the house even before they entered into the house there, there's always been that thing and that's what they have for each other is genuine likeness that is just that that's what is going on between them and for the other ladies they asked him about you they asked him about kim 
he said that with them they'll be friends since and that is what's going to continue happening that's going to remain friendship so i guess he's not going to try to pursue anything with kim for alex he said she just became like really aggressive towards him when she like when um she saw that he was really like very competitive with the game and everything she just became really aggressive towards him then what else i think that's basically it for him he said he enjoyed his season more than this his experience in the season was better than this because this one it just took a lot of mental strength for him to push and then for eleba she said the reason she came for this season is to showcase herself that during her time we didn't really see a lot of like you know we didn't really see eleba like that so she came for that reason and she didn't know that she was going to even get to the finals but you know look at her now look at me now she ended up winning the show then with cross obviously she said there was nothing serious it was just they're just having fun and she, um it's going to continue to remain that way then for as for winning the money she said that um she's going to take her time and not just rush into something she didn't take her time and know what she's going to use the money for and also try to get direction from some people and she spoke about grace if it's your time it's your time and you know that was it for her when is your time is your time when is your grace is your grace this <laughs> in my head and that's on her for adequately you guys know that he came in with the bad boy dex situation he said that that was his plan was to just get to interact more with ladies get to talk to more ladies but <laughs> As situations we have it that was not possible he had to stay in one place and he said he noticed venita in the first week where he threw a joke kind of like an intellectual joke and venita caught up to, um you know venita was the only one that got it so it's like okay nice one and he's attra attracted to um intelligent ladies so that's what caught his attention and that's where everything started from for that dinner he said that um things were not they didn't really have time to talk about their issues before the dinner that's why the dinner went the way it did and moving forward we don't know we are gonna watch and see what's gonna happen between them for cross he spoke about kim just being very happy that she came into the house that that really like would i say lifted his spirits because it was, it was the house wasn't really like very um sweet i've been mean, interested to him but when she came he was very happy that she came in he spoke about parrot too that you know there are certain things that happened and it was just like okay let's just and take a step back and observe and see what will happen but i believe they'll be good cha like you know how Perry is now cross is i believe that their friendship is still going to stand regardless of what happened in the house for cc they did not post hers at the time of making this video video they had not posted hers but i'm sure you're going to watch it directly so i'm going to maybe include the link in the description box so you guys can watch it directly or just check african magic tv um youtube channel but i'm going to do that yeah so that's it for this video thanks for watching and do not forget to give it a thumbs up and i'm going to see you on the next one bye i love you